morning and a gloomy start to the day. Yes, halfway through the week mm -hmm. and it looks like we're not going to see much sun the whole week. You, probably not till Saturday, but the timing mm. for a lot of us, the weekend, mm. right? That's true, yeah, you yeah. want your weekend to look good. And I do think today will be better than yesterday. I mean, I guess yesterday the standards were so low. I mean, it was just <laughs> nasty it was the whole For low day. standards, it wasn't bad. I mean, <laughs> folks would probably say, you know, 30s and rain, a lot of folks would be I like, think you know what? I think it's the worst Can weather, we, personally. Yeah, it's like, at least when it's snowy out, at least like it's brighter and, right. you know, you just don't have that nasty raw feel. Uh, but today, we're not expecting much rain during the daylight hours. It's not till after tonight, after dark, I should say. That's when the rain's going to move back in. However, it does look like clouds are going to linger. It looks like we're clearing out here, but we have a lot of low clouds that will probably be hanging around throughout the day today. We're not going to have much wind, so the atmosphere is not going to mix out. You know, when you have the longer days, sometimes the sunshine can go to work and kind of beat down on the cloud cover, and we will eventually see some sunshine. Uh, but that's not going to really be the case today. A lot of low-level clouds, so that's going to keep temps in the 40s, but that's still better than yesterday. We're basically looking at yesterday's highs, what we are now in the 30s. Notice the hill towns are in the 40s. Great Barrington right now uh, at 46 degrees. I think Berkshire County will actually be the mildest with temps in the 50s. While in the Valley, those of us in the Valley, most of us here will be down uh, seeing temps in the 40s, which is still above normal by a long shot for this time of year. So the normal high is about 34. So plenty of cloud cover throughout the day today, 45 to maybe about 50 degrees. Then the rain moves in after dark. We'll have periods of rain overnight tonight with temperatures in the 40s. And we'll likely pick up about a half an inch of rainfall. Now tomorrow is a possible first alert weather day. Not that we have a big storm coming or snow or anything like that. However, there's gonna be some leftover low level moisture with cold air draining in that could create some slippery spots with some freezing drizzle and some light icing and that would be mainly for Franklin County and for the hill towns that's where temperatures will fall to right around 32 degrees all untreated surfaces especially the driveways and the walkways could potentially become slick and icy you know it's not like we're having a lot of precipitation but it doesn't take much to create hazardous travel and especially when you're walking when you have conditions like that so that light freezing rain and freezing drizzle. I think for a lot of us from Northampton to Springfield, the lower valley, it's just going to be plain drizzle. It's the areas you see shaded here in the purple. That's where the National Weather Service has put out a winter weather advisory, and that goes into effect early tomorrow morning and through the day tomorrow with those pockets of freezing drizzle. But again, Northampton, Springfield, uh, central and eastern parts of Hampton and Hampshire County, I think temperatures will be 35, between 35 and 40. It will be between 30 and 35, the areas that you see shaded in the purple. So as the kids head off to school this morning, no worries about any ice, just clouds and areas of fog, middle and upper 30s as they're heading home. Plenty of cloud cover, but dry temperatures likely in the mid 40s. And tomorrow there's the clouds and the dreary conditions tomorrow as well. And we'll have pockets of freezing drizzle and ice across the hills and higher terrain. Plenty of clouds on Friday. It looks like maybe a rain or snow shower. The bulk of the day is dry, upper 30s. And then finally a return to some sunshine as we head into the weekend especially Sunday, but even Saturday, a little sun, lower 40s, a little cooler on Sunday, upper 30s. All right, another check of the forecast in a few minutes. Amanda and David, back to you. Thanks, Dan.